Hi, I come to share a weekly word with you, and this week's word is take up your bed and walk. You know, God wants us to be movers. He wants us to move in faith and trust him. And in, in the Bible, they talked about a man for 38 years was not whole. And Jesus saw him at the well and said, do you want to be made whole? And the man says, I have no one to help me. He's just laying there. I have no one to help me into the pool. And God says, take up your bed and walk. And he was made whole. And I'm telling you today that you cannot sit idly waiting on something to happen. You have to move in faith. Trust God and believe. Take up your bed and walk. If you say you want to go to school, guess what? It takes signing up for school and taking that first class. If you say you want a job, you got to start looking for a job. No one's just going to come magically show up and give you one. Just keep trying, keep trying, keep trying. But take up your bed and walk, move, show some actions. I, I know I done told y'all this story several times how many jobs I have not gotten. How many no's I got. I can't even tell you how many. But it takes going through a whole lot of no's to get a yes. And I know it gets discouraging, but you still got to show up every day. Take up your bed and walk. Move. Show actions. If you want to make a change, you got to show you want to make a change. You got to do more than just say it. You got to take up your bed and walk. Change. Start being more generous. Start being more kind. Start being more loving. Start being nicer. Have you noticed you may not be equipped with everything, but God has a way when he touches, he multiplies. You're like, well, I don't know if I really got all the skills for that. But seem like God multiplies those skills. He'll bring somebody along to help you learn and grow. He'll touch that thing and it'll be multiplied. So I encourage you today, whatever it is you want to do, if you want to make a change, if you want to do something different, if you want to strive, if you want to be a better saver, it takes saving that surf, surf, first penny. You got to show actions. You can't just keep talking about it. If you want to start investing, you got to start doing something. If you're eating out 10 times a month, eat out eight. I'm not telling you to stop eating out. And the other two times, put that in some type of investment, in some type of savings. You have to do something. You have to act and not sit around, idling around, waiting on somebody. It's not teach a man to fish. It's not keep fishing for him. So if you're waiting on somebody to keep fishing for you or keep moving for you and move on your behalf, if you keep waiting for a handout, use it while you need it. But take up your bed and walk. Let your actions lead today. Trust God and move in faith. And watch him show out. Show up and show out. So I encourage you today, take up your bed and walk. Know that you are loved. I love you, but God truly loves you the most. Remember to always be kind to yourself and others. Be joyful and be blessed. And y'all have a beautiful and blessed week. Love you much. Bye. Let's move, y'all.